Welcome back to Drinks and Chill. My name is Joe. This is Matt. And today is episode two of yes. our series. The miniature... Miniature mini, reviews. Miniature reviews. Of the miniature bottles. Of the miniature bottles. Yeah. Yep. Eventually we'll lose count of what episode it is of this series, but... Will we? Oh, yeah, I guess yeah, so. I mean, yeah. if we're going to keep doing this. Yeah. So... Okay. So today we are doing an Indian whiskey. Indian. Yes. From we don't do those very often here on the channel, but yep. we have this miniature. So this is Nirvana, uh, Paul John Nirvana, unpeated single malt whiskey, Ooh. product of Goa, India. Okay. Okay. Never been to Goa. Me neither. Never been to India. Me neither. All right. All right. Knows it. This is a lot lighter than we tried. Oh, oh yeah, like the color of it. Mm -hmm. Yeah. The hurricane. <laughs> oh, that's very different. It smells like butter, burnt butter. Okay, so we had what was it? Butterscotch, caramel. Was it caramel and butterscotch that we? Okay, yeah. Oh no, it was honey and butterscotch. Oh. Wait. No, it was caramel. No, no. It was it, it was, was honey, honey and butterscotch. Honey and butterscotch. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. And so just butter. At first it was, yeah. No, it's still butter in me. Cardboard. No, it's still butter in me. Well, there's still butter in there, but there's other things other than butter. Or are you just getting butter? I'm just getting butter. <laughs> okay, there's no sharpness to this, which is no. nice. Yeah. It's only 40%. Yeah, there's like a, a cardboardy, like newspapery sort of thing happening back there too. I'm getting some floralness to it. Yeah. I am getting honey. Which is kind of interesting because it's always honey versus butterscotch, but this one's honey versus butter without well, a scotch. I don't think so. I think there's just, it just has butter and honey because a lot of, a lot of times we can't decide is it honey or is it butterscotch. Yeah. But this time I think we are getting both. Yeah, the so, cardboard's the big one for me though. Butter and cardboard. You know, I'm not getting cardboard at all. Really? Yeah. Find the taste. I just find it crazy that I'm not getting cardboard. Okay, that was sharp on the taste. It was. Like instantly. Cardboard. I don't like the taste. No, I don't care for that, but I don't care for it that much either. And I don't want to say what it tastes like. All right, let me taste it again and kind of figure stuff out and then you say what it tastes like. I don't want to say what it tastes like. Like, do you have something in mind? I do. Oh, okay, well, say it, but no, not yet. No, I don't want to. Don't, well, don't say it yet. I don't like this. It's not that flavorful, but the flavor that I am getting, I don't like. Like I know in the past I've said, oh, it tastes like cardboard, but in a good way. This is not a good way. It's it's a, a bad way. All right, say what you're gonna say. I don't wanna say it. You have I, to say it. I don't wanna say it. Well, too bad. You can't, you don't always get what you Wait, want. Can I skip this one? Can I skip saying this one? That's like the first time I ever wanna skip saying what I think it is. Just say Not it. think it is. Okay, let me try it one more time. Hold on, let me drink water. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay, here it goes. Please, I change. There's like Please. a little, there's like a candy corn in there too. Okay. Candy corn, cob cardboard. Candy what else? corn, cardboard. Like a, a very bitter coffee. Bitter coffee. Yeah, okay. Like too bitter coffee. Like I'm, if I I'm, drink it, I'd be like, oh, I gotta add some milk to this. Okay. I'm using that to change my mind. Are you gonna try and find those? Yeah. <clears throat> I'm gonna pour myself a little bit more just to try and redeem this one. Okay, I got some coffee, like a strong black coffee. Yeah. Okay, I'm getting some sweetness in it now. Okay. All right, it's a lot better, like 10 times better than what I was thinking. Maybe even 20 times better than I was thinking. I feel like the more I try it, the more I like. I like redeeming qualities I find in it. Maybe it just needs to like sit for a little bit. Yeah, this one definitely needs to sit. It's still not one of my favorites. But no, not one of my favorites. But I still want to hear what you initially. Are you kidding? No, oh. I don't want to say it. No, say I'm it. I'm so worried. Just say it. Okay. Let me try it one more time. <laughs> okay, so you know, like after you drank so much and you decide to, you decide to vomit and you vomit. But that aftertaste you get from your vomit with that, like that bile and like stinging sensation. Yeah. That's exactly what I got. Oh, Just that God. lingering okay. taste. 
yeah. that you just want to rinse your mouth right away, mm -hmm. that's what I got. Dang. And the reason why I don't want to say it is because that's, that's pretty bad. <laughs> and I didn't want that to be impressionable for you. Mm. Well, that's why I said, like, okay, let me figure out what I got. And then once I, I felt confident, like, okay, I think I've got what I'm going to get from here. Go ahead and say it. Yeah. Yeah. So that's what I got. I can, honestly, I can kind of see where you're and coming from. That, but that it, initial sharpness, and you know, like the aftertaste, you're like, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. yeah. And then that bile kind of creeped in there and just wasn't good. That's yeah. why I said it's like 10 times better now, 20 times better. Yeah. I give it a 5.9. 5.9? Mm -hmm. Okay. I give it a four. Okay. And that's still considered 10 times better. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Honestly, I feel like I gave it a little bit too high. It was one of those things like the more I tasted it, the more I liked it. And we don't have that much of it. And I don't mm -hmm. want to keep tasting it because we still have more to do. But yeah. I'm thinking like if I taste it again, I'll like it more, which is why I gave it kind of high. Even, even though 5.9 is low, I feel like that's still high for this. Yeah. Well, right. that is it for the second installment of our miniature reviews. Let us know down in the comments if you've had Paul John Nirvana or any other uh, whiskeys by Paul John that you actually liked. And uh, until then, thank you so much for watching. Leave a like, comment, subscribe, hit that notification bell so you know whenever we post. And we will see you next time. Cheers. Cheers.